in you know Vin Pickles uh, uh, right. bio. He sounds like a smart guy. Hubs to T, dad to R. Uh, hey, why don't you ask T if she'd be into that and see if she cracks you across the mouth. I'm the grandpa. No, I'm the normal one. I'm the one who's actually it's, it's, living a life that's accepted in society. Listen, everybody's everybody's dream is to do whatever you want, whenever you want. But we have to live within certain like well, it, it's constraints. But, but it's Why? not even it's not even that. Then like, don't get married. But, but I'm not it, saying but you have to get married. I don't care what society says. Do what you want. But I'm just asking the question: If you want to be, if you don't want to be monogamous. Why get married? I, I don't. I don't see that now. If your wife needs a green card, if you, if something's happening financially, all right, then you got to do it. But if you say that this is the love of my life, this is the person I want to spend the rest of my life with, have children with, then I would think you wouldn't have an appetite to have to be with other women. And if you had an appetite to be with other women, then you wouldn't get married. That's all. So I don't. It's not even about convention, Michael. Well, it's just that if you're going to go through the women, trouble. I- well, Why? Yeah, if you if you want show listen, me a, show me a guy show me a man who's married and, and very often a woman who's married I'll show you someone who has an appetite well, no, for yeah, someone yeah but they don't act but on it they don't act on it because, because I respect you, you, you use the word appetite are, are words not words you right. use the word I, I'm real, honestly let's move on please yeah. uh, for it's, God's it's, sakes can we please do something else I, I don't understand Christ's why you're getting sake. so angry. Why are you getting angry? Because it's stupid, I, I, all right? No, it's not. No, I'm not going to get into a freaking stupid. argument about this, something that's stupid like this. And I'm not going to get in an argument with Twitter over stupid garbage like this, all right? It's For God, no, I'm no, I'm, I'm, I'm done. What is wrong with Are you okay? Uh, no, I mean, uh, no a, I'm not. I'm really not, okay? But this is a reasonable people No, it's have not this reasonable. Oh, no, this time. is stupid. I'm all for having fun and going off the beam. But this I, is, there's an article in the New Yorker last week right, about polyamorous relations. It's real right. life. All right, so what? Uh, good. Have it without me, please. Oh, my God. You guys are. No, no. What, what, what am I, Peter? What am I? You're you're acting like a lunatic. All right, yeah, that's uh, abs- I don't understand. Like it's, it's, it's just, just not worth getting in a listen. stupid argument and be called an old man. And I, I just don't need it. I, it's enough with the sports. I got I, now. I got to have have an opinion on this garbage. <laughs> they call me an old man, Don. Fair so point. don't worry. No, about I'm it. just. Uh, yeah, I'm was tired it Michael? It. For God's sake, I was no, but, Grandpa. Oh boy, God, I'm so done. This is this is tough. What's that? What's happened here? It's just no, a no, no, no. I I understand his frustration because we're wow. actually we're actually the ones that are living life the way society. And then you know this. I'm not even going to take Matthew. Don and Michael are robots. No, no. The whole society's robots. Don't get. I'm not saying yet. You're the you're the ones that think that. Well, society dictates you have to get married. If you want to sleep around, sleep around. But why? But, you but, you, but, to one but there's a connotation when you say sleeping around. There's a connotation that comes with that. There are people out there who want to get into a loving relationship with someone and then over time as years go on they look at each other and go this is boring in certain aspects we love certain aspects we're bored in other aspects what could we do could we find an arrangement that works for us while still being a family and being in love oh yeah sure Every other Saturday night, you go put a pineapple in your cart at the grocery store and go do your thing. I'll see you on Sunday for breakfast. Why does that make them somehow bad if they decided that works for them? And for me, with, I think what, it would be it would be too complicated. I think I don't see how it really would work. What would you but do if with you the can kids make on Saturday work, night? What would you do with the kids on Saturday night while you're you know? Going, what do you do with the kids when you and Jody go out on Saturday night? You you, you get a babysitter. Exactly. But how do you, I, I well, they know that mommy and daddy are going to see a movie. Uh, mommy's going to see Bill and have sex with him, and daddy's going to see Laura, and he's going to hook up with her. You can explain that, would that be to probably, your ten-year-old. That would probably be more information than you do. You, do you report to your ten-year-olds when a couple has sex? That doesn't even make sense. You would say we're going out with friends. I'm, what? Listen, I'm not saying it has to be for you or for me, but I'm just saying the idea of shutting it down because something we don't know is silly. To me, that's silly, even if it doesn't work for me. I, I don't know what works for people. Who am I to judge? You're no one to judge. So when we get back, ENN will be here, but first Peter's going to tell you about FanDuel.